a lot of advisors tell us, well, I have my clients focused on the right thing. They're in it for the long haul and my phone doesn't ring off the hook when the market drops. That's great. But that doesn't mean your clients don't want to hear from you. When returns take a hit, it hits the headlines. Even the most level-headed, future-focused clients could use your seasoned perspective. That's why they hired you. So what's the right thing to say? Try borrowing a page from one of these three advisors. The stock market is the only market where things go on sale and all of the customers run out of the store. Human emotions can override our better judgment when it comes to investing. And a lot of emotions come with it. Hope, excitement, fear, greed. This story from Birch Run Financial was written to be timeless, even though the script feels timely. The message could have worked in the spring of 2020, any time in 2022, and it will still be relevant in the future. One of the most important pieces of messaging in a down market is just saying the right thing. Listen to how Leo Walker of Wells Fargo Advisors puts it. Wouldn't you love to have a crystal ball to tell you what the future holds, <laughs> especially for the markets? A lot of people try to predict what's going to happen, and they're even right sometimes. <laughs> so is a broken clock twice a day but predictions are not usually consistent or reliable. So I have a different kind of market forecast for you with six hard truths based on decades of experience and facts about investing and human behavior. Six hard truths really makes me wanna watch. Finally, if you've heard us talk about good messaging, then you've heard this one before. Get personal. Getting personal is what makes you memorable. How does that work when you're talking about the markets? Check this one out. After a hike, you don't think about every single individual step you took. You think about that beautiful view you saw at the top that made the climb, no matter how challenging, totally worth it. The same goes for investing. You can't look at each individual day in the market as a predictor for what your portfolio will look like in the future. You have to look at the big picture Wilson McDonald of Leonard & Martins was mainly talking about the market, but listen to how he ends the story on a personal note. Just as I guide and encourage my kids when hiking, so they don't get bogged down in small challenges along the trail, we are here to help you on your journey, so you can see the beauty at the top of the mountain. Need help figuring out how to turn the right thing to say into a video that easily gets your message out? That's what Idea Kit is all about.